a restaurant in Roswell with sexual crimes involving two minors. Roswell police tell us they arrested Brandon Ippolito and have charged him with solicitation of sodomy with a minor and other very serious charges. Fox 5's Angelique Proctor joins us live from the Roswell Police Department. Angelique, obviously a very disturbing story. Absolutely. You know, we do know that Brandon Epolito has now bonded out of the Fulton County Jail. Roswell police tell us this all started when Milton High School officials came to them saying that there was some possible inappropriate behavior involving minors. Well, they began investigating, and one month later, they have charged Brandon Epolito with four counts. Now, the 47 year old suspect and restaurant owner has been linked to two victims. Both are 16 years old. Detectives say the first First victim is female. Ippolito allegedly sent obscene material to her through cyberspace and was reportedly involved in a relationship with the minor. The second victim is a 16-year-old male who police say was subjected to several inappropriate uh, sexual materials. Now, Ippolito is charged with cruelty to children in that case. We did ask detectives how the suspect and the two victims are connected. It's kind of family related, um, as well as just family connection. The one with the furnishing obscene um, material and solicitation of sodomy and contributing to the delinquency of a minor, you know, that's going to be the bigger relationship there. That's the on ongoing relationship. And you have, um, you got cyberspace and then also possibly um, in person there. Now, we have learned and want to stress that Brandon Epolito is not affiliated with the Epolito's restaurants in Alpharetta or Swanee. The family apparently sold those restaurants some 20 years ago, and they are now privately owned. We are reporting live in Roswell. Angelique Proctor, Fox 5 News.